In this video, we will demonstrate how to get started using Person Studio and how to create your first project. When starting Studio, you will see the welcome screen containing six pages of information. We recommend reading this, but when you are finished, you should turn off this for next startup. If clicking this new project icon in the toolbar, you will by default get the wizard. If you turn it off, you will still be able to get the wizard by using File New and starting it. In the wizard, your first choice is which language to use. Since Parson Studio can store several languages, this is an important setting and you should choose the language which you will use for your project. If you change it, you can say this should be the default in all new projects. Next choice is file format. You normally choose Studio 9 file format. You also have the ability to choose between a calendar dependent simulation or if choosing calendar independent, the time will simply run from 0 to 100 for instance, all by your choice. Useful for very short time periods or similar. Which calendar to use? That is covered in another video but normally you choose a bank calendar giving a total of 360 days per year. The series resolution is also covered in another video. The most important setting for your project is when to start, when to stop and the time steps of your project. For now we'll keep this running one year with daily time steps. At last you get a summary showing how your project will look like. If you need to change between normal and advanced user interface, you can right click anywhere on any button or menu and you will get the pop-up menu. The first choice on this pop-up menu is the choice between normal or advanced. You see if choosing advanced you get, get many more choices now I turn it back to the normal user interface. 